It seems like a small thing to most people, but it is my lifeline. Ever so slowly, Brandy Ray is getting around on her own, focusing all her energy on putting one foot in front of the other. She's using a walker after her $8,000 custom-made wheelchair was taken. What I think I can do and what I can really do is not the same thing. Just going down the hallway to the bathroom and coming back is like a marathon. Realizing the walker wouldn't work long term, Brandy turned to national seating and mobility in Urbandale, hoping to borrow a chair until hers is returned or she comes up with money for a new one. And I was like, what am I going to do? Um, I don't have money for a new wheelchair. I have classes. I've got kids. I can't just stop my whole entire life because of this. The single mother of two was diagnosed with transverse myelitis at age 13, a neurological disease caused by inflammation of the spinal cord. She'll be in a wheelchair the rest of her life. I just said, okay, well, there's nothing I can do to change it. I'm going to have to deal with it. She has such a positive outlook on life. Um, she, well, she's just awesome. After several trial and error transfers, Brandy found a set of wheels that will make getting around. I feel better already. A little more bearable. Thank you, Jason. No problem. Um, Thank you, Brandy. Brandy says she doesn't care who took her chair or why, she just wants it back. Well, here's a picture of that wheelchair. Once again, if you have any information about it, you're asked to call Des Moines Police. Live in the studio, Kim St. Ange, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.